Gracious Heavenly Father, Lord, we are taking this opportunity with both hands this morning. Lord, nothing of ourselves, but everything from you this morning. We are not, Lord, able to do this, but it is you, Lord. It is by your strength and it's by your power, Lord Jesus, that we are able this morning to stand Lord, and to be able to turn the pages of the Bible this morning. Yara dankie vir a godelike voorig soos hierdie weer eens vir ochend. Ons waardeer u vir ochend uit die diepte van ons harte uit die Heere. Ons aanbid u vir morgen, ons is dankbaar. We are thankful, we are grateful. We have so much this morning. To be thankful, Lord Jesus. Father, we pray that, Lord, as we come, Lord, towards the end of this little subject, talking about, Lord, these core values of a Christian, important values, how to maintain these values. Yara, see in the word for more. And the leaf look on now. Father, say, Yara, Jesus Christ. Bless your word. Bless all. The listeners this morning bless your word as it father goes forth in power and in strength lord in the name of jesus christ we pray amen and amen god bless you uh, brothers and sisters we greet you all in the wonderful name of our lord and savior jesus christ Wat kan ons vanmorgen sê, ons kan net sê, dit is Godse genade. Niks anders as die genade van die Heere nie. En ek denk, ek kan vanmorgen met my saam stem en sê, dit is die waarheid, my broer. Ons leven vanmorgen net dier die genade van ons Heere Jesus Christus. En this morning, we want to turn with you in the book of Romans chapter 13 and we will pick up another few verses as we come into the closing of this wonderful, wonderful text. The more I read, or how can I say, the more I, I speak about this uh, wonderful text, the more God adds, you know, things to us and give us more inspiration when we talk about these core values of being a Christian. I think that is the greatest desire that God, one of the greatest desires that God can ever have is to see that we as a body of believers, that we love out these, this, these core values, these um, uh, values, the values that He for us has I think the Lord will be here tomorrow as He sees that we us these values embrace how we can sustain and uplift and protect and maintain these, these Christian values. Met die geestelike en godelike waardes, amen, how to maintain them. And as we close off by talking this morning, how to present, hallelujah, hierdie waardes, hoe om hulle ten toon te stel, by sy naam van die Heere, and remember that all these values come from God. All the good values come from God. Romans chapter 13 says that in verse 11, uh, and that knowing the time, that now it is high time to awake, as work tijd om wakker te word, out of sleep, for now is our salvation nearer, then we went nearer than when we believed. As wacht it om wakker te word en te besef dat ons redding, amen, is naderder as wat het is, amen, van dat ons gegloe het. Like we said yesterday, amen, one of these important uh, uh, facts or how can I say this morning place it to you important things that we have to do in protecting or uplifting 
on maintaining these Christian values is that uh, every believer, amen, that we as the body of Christ, amen, that we need one another. Ons het mekaar nodig. En om daar die, om daar die waarde systeem, amen, te beskerm, halleluja, amen, ons het mekaar nodig. We as the believers, amen, like we said yesterday, that we, at the gathering of the saints, the assembling of the saints, when we, when we come together, you know, and to encourage one another, you know, how important that is to strengthen, amen, the weaker Christian, the weaker believer, amen, hallelujah, and be able to, to maintain that, amen, hallelujah, on its to under whole, hallelujah, and to make sure that, that it does not rust away, Hallelujah. Like we said in the beginning that we put many times people, they, they put value on things that is not valuable. We are away from all those things. Amen. We have come to a place that we are realizing what is valuable to us. And as by dinge for more wat nie waardevol is nie. Amen. Al, al wel ons dit nodig het, we need a good car, we need a home, we need a good job. Those things are fine. But, you know, those things, we can lose it in a blink of an eye. We can lose it, you know, any any moment. Amen. And and then we, we, we can do without those things. But the values, Christelike waardes, wat die Heere vir ons gegeet, wat recht oor die Bijbel is, praise die naam van die Heere, those things we cannot lose. You cannot lose faith. Geloof is a vaste vertrouwen. Joy, the godly joy, the happiness, you know, to forgive one another. Patience, brotherly kindness. You know, all that wonderlijke waardes om a Christen te wees. Amen. Om te reageer op die woord van die Heere. The times we are, and that is very important, I just actually underline this, and the times that we are in, I wrote this and I underlined it, and I want to just say it to you this morning, the times we are in demands that the believer should be very watchful and very prayerful. Een van die, een van die grootste waardes, Amen. Wat we ons gaan staande hou, is gebed. And I underline this, the times that we are living in now, it is challenging moments. Dis uit dagende tye waarin ons nou lewe. Ons word uitgedaag tot op die uiterste. And what is important for us in this challenging times that we are living in, this times demands that every believer be very, very much watchful and prayful. And that is why we have read this scripture in the book of Romans, chapter 13, verse 11, that the Bible says, Paul says, that, that we now, it is high time to wake up, amen, out of sleep, for now is our salvation nearer than when we believe. As no date om wakker te wees. Praise die naam van die Heer. And we want to pray this morning with you and ask the Lord, hallelujah, amen, to, to, uh, to waken, to waken us up, amen, that we can realize that how important it is now. That is no detail. And I want to say it again, this is now the time for us, amen, hallelujah, to to, to, to live out these godly values, om al hierdie goddelike waardes uit te leef, alles wat ons, or everything that we've learned through the years, amen, that has, wat ons geleer het, amen, all these wonderful preachings that we have uh, sit under, 
and all the ministers of the gospel that have so faithfully teached us these core values. Hierdie belangrike waardes dit is tyd het aangebreek dat ek en u hier die waardes moet uitlewe broers en sisters. Amen. The time demands that the time that we are living in now demands that we live out these core values that we live out amen these values amen we must awake out of sleep we must we have to be vigilant what does the word vigilant means it means that we have to be alert that we have to be watchful ons moet waakzaam wees Amen. We have to be vigilant. We have to be alert. Ons moet. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We have to be alert. We have to be on the watch. Amen. We have to be watch, watchful. Praise the name of the Lord. Ons moet wakker wees achter die woord, achter die woord van Christus. En ons wil vanmorgen afsluit om te lees dat ons die voordele you know the, the 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 benefits you know of these core values the waardes van hierdie hierdie to uphold these values second timothy amen chapter 2 verse 12 if we suffer amen look at this look at the benefits of this of this or look at look at the benefits of this values um, you know, if we suffer, Paul says, if we suffer, we also reign with him. If we, de- if we deny him, he also will deny us. If we believe not, yet we abide faithful. He cannot deny himself. Amen. The Bible says, if we suffer, we shall reign. We shall also reign with him. Kijk naar die voordeel. If you, amen, hallelujah, go to any company, amen, hallelujah, and you want a policy, amen, and they want you, they will show you all the benefits, amen. If you die, you'll get this amount. If you this this amount, they show you all these benefits, amen, hallelujah. And you take that, you know, because they promise so many things. Hulle beloof is so baie voordele, prijs die naam van die Heere. Maar ons het oor en oor gesien, dierbaar is, dat wanneer het kom, wanneer hierdie groot companies moet uitbetaal, dat is altijd een groot, groot issue. But there is a company, a heavenly company, an insurance company this morning. Hallelujah, eternal life. Amen, hallelujah, my precious friend, my precious brother. You that doesn't know Christ as your personal Savior. I want to say this to you this morning. Amen. If we are willing to suffer, amen, for this gospel, amen, hallelujah, and upholding these core values, these values, amen, hallelujah. And remember to uphold these values. It is not always easy because you will not always be in favor of, of the people. Je mag miskien nie in, in, in gins wees van die mens daar buiten nie. Amen. Hallelujah. Remember, amen, to uplift these godly values. Amen. You might not have friends. Amen. But Paul says, in suffering, amen, hallelujah, you shall reign. I rather suffer upholding these values. Ek sal eerder Amen, hallelujah, uh, swart koffie drink en een snakey droog brood eet, as om te compromeer, net om met die wereld gelijkstaande te wees. We don't have to compromise with this world, amen, to enjoy the benefits of this world, hallelujah. We don't have to compromise with our friends, we don't have to compromise in our workplaces, we don't have to compromise in our community, amen, hallelujah. Amen. Just to just to be a, a figure out there. No, sir. Amen. Die waardes waarmee die Heere ons ge, ge, geseen het. Amen. You don't have to compromise. Ministers of the gospel, you don't have to compromise because what God has given you, amen, is more than what money or what popularity can give to you. Amen. Daar die waardes, die goddelike waardes om te staan 
van hier die evangelie, like a Shadrach, Misek en Abednego, they stood for those values, like a Daniel of Oates, he stood for those values, he was being cast into a lion's den, he stood for those values, like, 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 like David, amen, hallelujah, when the whole Israel were not able to uphold those values, David came to the battlefield, amen, hallelujah, and he, he showed them what these values, what the benefits of these values is. He wees vir hulle, as a kind, die waardes van om a christen te wees. Amen, hallelujah. Gevul met die dooping van die heilige gees. Amen, hallelujah. He says, if no one wants to go, I will go. He showed them what these values mean. Let us go out there this morning. Kom ons wees vir die devil. Amen. Wat die die waardes vir ons beteken. Halleluja. Jimmelse Vader, my gebed vanmorgen is, hierdie laaste paar dae, het ons gepraat oor hierdie waarde systeem. Jere, dat ons as christene, jere, daar sal uit moet gaan, en die wereld kan wees, die waardes waarom jy God ons geseen het. Jere, waarom ons sekere dinge nie doen nie, Heere. Vader, omdat ons die waardes, we upholding the values of God. And now as we are closing down on this wonderful text, we want to pray, O oh God, that as your bride, as the body of God, Lord, as they leave their homes, that may nothing else but let them, let them reflect those godly values, thy waardes, thy godelike waardes, Heere sal verteenwoordig en op hoog hou, Heere, so die wereld weet dat ons kinders van God is. Amen.